And here we go, UK Cats. We are back in here for some college basketball. I'm having fun. I don't know if the viewers having fun, but this is one of my favorite games. It's kind of like one of those things, man. I got to play my favorite game. And unfortunately, y'all got to watch, even if y'all not interested in it. Whatever, we're back at home going three and one, and we're still ranked top teams in the country, top 25. We got Bowling Green from Ohio in Rupp Arena, and we win the tip. And look at this. Oh, spin in the lane and a rejection. And we got a double here at the top with DeMarcus Cousin way out on the top. And he drives, cuts to the lane, and he shoots it off the side of the backboard. Hey, I just don't show you the highlights around here. And we got a trap on the wing. Tie up. Defense is getting after it. And coach is feeling it. Our defense definitely has improved. I'm not a big fan of a 2-3 zone, but I had to employ it to get our offense working. Dotson with a good uh, jumper from the wing. There's us giving up another offensive rebound, and Bowling Green's going to employ a press. We got a nice little jumper here, and we got bricks. As you can see, I just don't show you the highlights. I'm showing you a lot of misses. DeMarcus Cousin on the boards, missing. Patrick Patterson following up, and now we got a 4-3 lead. There John Wall is. A big, long three, and there's a trap on the wing and a almost a turnover. And let me tell you something. Since employing this 2-3 zone, it definitely has made a difference. DeMarcus Cousin with a deflection leading to a uh, score on the other end by Eric Bledsoe. Easy three-point shot in Kentucky all over Bowling Green. There's our defense stepping up again. The best offense is a good defense. And DeMarcus Cousin, easy transition dunk and that looks like to me an 11 0 run and that's gonna lead to a timeout by bowling green they got an easy dunk, uh uh start in there but kentucky has been putting the run on bowling green we're turning back a block on the inside bowling green is eating a lot of dust right now and we're turning a good defense into an offense and dotson misses a three-pointer but DeMarcus Cousin gets the rebound. John Wall has the ball. He's looking to get the offense started. Cut into the basket. DeMarcus Cousin with an easy banger. And here's more defensive pressure by Kentucky in that 2-3 zone. And here's another easy conversion in the lane. Right hand coming from the left side of the floor. Another deflection in the 2-3 zone. And let me tell you something. This is one of the games. Dotson, I'm sorry, Bledsoe, three-pointer, miss. But the defense definitely has given us opportunities that we didn't create for ourselves in the previous game. Easy turnaround jumper in the lane for Bowling Green, and they get their first basket in a long time. Out on the perimeter, John Wall showing up again, yet again, in one of his favorite spots. Here it is, another trap and another deflection by Kentucky. And this is promising. I'm looking for something to spark our team on the offensive end, and this is it. Another block in the lane. Kentucky coming down in transition, and there's an easy pass. No-look pass in the lane. Easy finish by DeMarcus Cousin, and Kentucky is on a wild run. A three-point three shot, block, a turnaround jumper, panic shot, and Bowling Green is all out of order at this point. There's John Wall in his favorite spot, three-pointer, and all of this pretty much there's another trap and there's another steal by kentucky boy i'm gonna tell you john wall with the behind the back fake pass easy layup for two points and bowling green with 20 seconds left in the first half calls a timeout stop the bleeding 25 to 6 the uk wildcats and this is how we should be playing and i'm gonna tell you something by the time we get to the meat of our conference schedule we should be ready easy but what in the world referee get man did he have a suitcase get the whistle out this guy traveled 10 miles all right john wall on the opposite side i'm sorry that's eric bledsoe at the end of the half in kentucky is blowing out bowling green up 20 points and if you take a look at the highlights here most of these scores came at the end of great defensive plays and we're limiting Bowling Green's opportunities to score on the inside. And we're finishing in the lane. Man, I'm going to tell you, man, it's fun. It's fun. College basketball is fun. Let's get back here into the second half and see what Bowling Green can do. As you can see, the game is getting away from them. 
big perimeter jumper, and they come out gangbusters. All right, big three-point play to come in. A pump fake, stay down. John Wall, one dribble pull up, two feet behind the line, and it's money. All right, here we got a defensive rebound off a of miss, and Kentucky is looking to drive the ball in transition. Kicks it out to Pat Patterson in the middle, going inside to DeMarcus Cousin. Jump hook, turn him to the middle, and misses but not too bad. He says, let's, coach says, let's try to get everyone to touch and reverse the ball. I thought we did a good job there. Coach, man, settle down, man. We up 20. No, man, we never settled down, man. We never satisfied. Bowling Green with an inside jump hook, and this is why you don't settle down. Patrick Patterson, easy on the inside, and another miss in a frustration foul. 91 feet from the op opponent's basket. That's not what you do, kids. Never foul that far away from the basket. John Wall with a baseline jumper, and that ruins the run by Kentucky. And as you can see, what a slithering move by Pat Patterson to get in the lane. Long three-pointer by Bowling Green, which turns into a miss, and Kentucky pushes the ball down the floor. And easy miss. All right, but I like the transition. That was a little bit of a four shot. 2-3 zone. Bowling Green throws the ball away for no apparent reason. And John Walls sneaks in with the right-hand layup. 37-13. to 13. This game is out of hand. Nice drive. Give and go. Layup to cut the lead down slightly to 22. But that's going to be a problem, man. You got to be able to get after John Wall. Too many three-pointers on the baseline is going to be problematic. And we got to hit the boards. Definitely got to hit the boards. Inside, up and under move by Bowling Green's. I don't know if the number, but that was a great move. You don't see too many upper numbers these days because everybody's a perimeter player. But they turn that score into an, a score on the opposite end, so it nullifies that up and under. Look at that. Turn around. Baseline. Touch. Jump hook. Turn around. Baseline to the middle. Jump hook. And they get the touch. Here we go. Converting the defense to offense. Getting the rebound. That's where it starts. Limiting offensive rebounds. Leading to an easy layup on the other end here's another play a defensive rebound limiting the opportunities easy pass into the lane left hand finish by demarcus cousin and he gets fouled referee where's the foul as you can tell we run away with this game got a little bit of home cooking it's good to be home we're ranked number 19 and it was a blowout and coach greg adam gets yet another win here especially on the home court what we're going to do, man, is we're going to go into the next game and see if we can keep hitting the perimeter jumpers, keep working on our defense, box out, limit them to one shot, and let our defense be our best offense. That's what we're looking for. As you can see, it was a 22-point win, and John Wall leading us again, 25 points and some assistances.